established. So we had the Earls of Kildare, the Kings, and then later the Lord of Kildare. So the Lord and Lady Kildare in the 1700s got on very well. They had 19 children. Then he died, might have been a bit tired, and she married the schoolmaster and went on to have a further three children. What a lady. So they decided to open a school, nearly fill it themselves. And it's coming up on the left, it's called Black Rock College. Here we are. Uh, nice school, particularly for rugby. Until 1968, we did not have free secondary education. So any of the boys who were going to school here, their parents were paying fees. And the boys who played rugby, they were going to do very well in life. They were going to network, start businesses, get more jobs. So these boys playing rugby became known as ruggers. When the European Union, ladies had to give up their jobs in the civil service. So nurses, secretaries, teachers, and outlets for ladies. So they thought, if I get with one of these ruggers, life will be a little bit easier for me. So they became known as rugger huggers. <laughs> so these are the brave rugger boys. Oh, they're only little. Guys, is when they're going to school. So these are a lot of the boys going to Black Rock College. Really? So this is secondary school. Oh. They begin at 12. <coughs> he looks like he's going to the school beside it, which is a primary school. And then across the way, there is a train station, so that a lot of people are coming in on the train. <coughs> Had to surfacing on this road. Um, After raiding for 45 years around Dublin Bay, they eventually went in and landed beside Trinity College in 840. We were obviously very scary. And they spent their first winter in Dublin. And they spent it behind Dublin Castle. The, the area was good. There was a pool of water where they could repair their log boats. And it was sheltered. The water was black, coming down from the bogs with all the iron in it. So black in Irish is dove. And a pool is lin. So we got dove lin which became Dublin. So that's the 
1941, Dublin was first founded. It was piffed over a few times, rebuilt, and the last iteration of that was the 1970s. There's a few buildings, we'll see them remaining from older days, but we've had a lot of turbulent 